Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Designer Slash Gamer, and today we're playing Lego Worlds. You guys remember Sheila? <laughs> so Sheila is hanging out by some incredible new brick builds that are available for a limited time. So make sure you log into your game and download them. And they're amazing. One of them is pirate themed. See this pirate flag over here. And the other one is sort of a Spanish style, amazingly beautiful vacation house. And it is on a dolphin shaped island. See that? That's a cute little dolphin's head. And the uh, pirate thing, pirate cave maybe, is on a crab shaped island. And we're going to check these out today. We're also going to check out another brick build up here in the clouds. Sort of a castle-y, dungeon-y type thing. So Sheila's on vacation. We're taking just this week off of building Jurassic World because <laughs> in real life, I am actually headed to the big YouTube conference, the annual conference. It's called VidCon. It's in California. So I had a very limited amount of time this week. It is not Sheila's fault at all. It's totally my fault. But I wanted to be sure that you guys got your Saturday morning episode of LEGO Worlds. So here we are. We're recording an episode for you guys. And don't worry, next week we will go right back to building LEGO Jurassic World. And we're actually going to build the Raptors Arena. So we're pretty uh, pumped about that, aren't we, Sheila? <laughs> Did you guys hear that pirate sound? So we've also brought a bunch of our friends here from Ivory City on vacation with us. See, there's the Yeti over here. We've got uh, chicken guy, chicken suit guy. We've got the constable over here. We've got blue spacesuit guy and many others. And they're all, they're all hanging out. We're all on vacation. We're gonna go sunbathing. And we're going to check out these incredible new brick builds. So we're here on the very first world that Sheila ever visited outside of the world of Ivory City. And as part of the tutorials, when you first start the game, when you have no gold bricks at all, it's called Pirate Playground. We figured this was a perfect spot to build these uh, new pirate themed brick builds and to hang out on vacation. So I could be wrong about this, you guys. I could be wrong. But this to me looks like it could have been built for the Survivor DLC in LEGO World. So I wonder, I wonder if they're going to release that pretty soon. Who knows? Maybe not. Maybe I'm totally off base, but it definitely seems like it could be survivor themed. All right, Sheila, do you want to go and check out these incredible brick builds? So this is going to be where Sheila's going to spend the night on her little vacation. We've got Piper up here. We've got Lady Meowington and even Rosie the Robot is here to help us uh, to hang out. You guys, I didn't even notice that plant moves. It's like a crab plant. So let's go ahead and check out these brick builds. So remember, if you haven't downloaded these brick builds yet, be sure that you do because they're only going to be available for a limited time. And right when you boot up the game, they're going to be available for you there in the main screen. And look at this amazing plant. You guys, this would be perfect for Jurassic World, don't you think, Sheila? I mean, that is so cool. All right, let's put this away. <gasps> Wait, there's something else to discover over here. Okay, let's get that too. So we're going to discover all this cool stuff. All right, let's go over here and let's head into this incredible house. And look, there's a little boat down here with a cannon on it. So, you know, just in case you get chased by some mean boat, mean other boat, you can attack it with the cannon. All right, let's go up in here. Let's go into Sheila's point of view. Even though she only has one eye, hmm, I'm surprised we're able to see just as well, even though Sheila has an eye patch on. Hey guys, how's it going? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> okay, let's go up these stairs. Because look how cool these stone stairs are. So these models are absolutely incredible. There is so much detail. Look at this. I love this covered patio. It's just really, really cool. And we got a little... Is this a barbecue out here, maybe? Got a barbecue out here. We have this really cool covered patio. And then we have a room in here. Oh, hey, buddy. Is that the ninja? Ooh, are these some new windows to discover? Oh, how cool is that? I think we already have those. Yes. Nothing else new in here to discover. Oh, we can go downstairs, too. I love this multi-leveled house. This is really neat. Ooh. Oh, 
What's down here? What's all this? Oh, you guys, I really like this architecture. This is really neat. <gasps> There's a little cage down here. All right, so if we uh, if we have to catch any skeletons or any bad guys, <laughs> looks like there have been some people that were captured and put in here too long ago. Is that a crab? <gasps> oh, you guys, I love these brick builds. All right, let's go upstairs and check out the rest of the house. So if you guys are enjoying the episodes, please uh, hit that like button and also subscribe if you haven't yet. And be sure to hit that little bell so that you get a notification every time Sheila has an amazing adventure. Man, you guys, this is so cool. Oh, sorry, I'm going to be gushing over this brick build for a while because it's just so well made. What's up, lady? Okay, let's go up this ladder. There's the ninja. Let's go up this ladder. You guys, look at the roof tiles. I love the way they did this. It'd be cool to build an entire Spanish-inspired village at some point. Oh, hey, Agent Chase. You guys, Sheila's boyfriend's up here. Hey, buddy. How's it going? What are you, what are you doing up here? So, you guys, this is a cannon. I don't think Sheila has this yet. We could use that on the ivory tower to keep some... Uh, bad people away. Hey, Agent Chase, how's it going, buddy? So, what's up, buddy? You're, are you up to, uh, you got any secret missions going on? No, you're just here to relax? Okay. Well, then, uh, come hang out with us later. We'll go, we'll go lay out or something, all right? <laughs> Sheila wants some color. She said she's feeling a little bit too yellow lately, so she wants to get some, some color in the sun. All right, let's go down here. Wait, did we see the rest of this yet? Oh, Sheila, what a amazing move Her. I love the little pirate sounds that she makes uh, let's uh, let's hop in this just so we can check it out here oh, that's pretty neat all right but Sheila you don't want to fire that because you don't know what will happen oh, Sheila oh, Sheila you got to be careful you could hit something no Sheila stop it oh my gosh all right that's enough you, you hop off there <laughs> So you guys, look at how cool this is. They did such an amazing job here. That's amazing. So I think we saw all of that. So wait, we didn't see this over here yet. Oh, we didn't go upstairs. Let's go back into Sheila's point of view and let's check this out. Oh, look at this gun rack. That's cool. And then there's a little tower right there. What an awesome brick build. All right, guys, let's go and check out that other brick build, uh, the pirate brick build. Let's see if we can go to, oh, I think I hear Piper. Pipey? <gasps> Hi, Piper. Hey, how's it going? Yes, we remembered to bring your sunscreen. 1,000 proof, yes, it's 1,000 proof. I don't think you need that much sun, like that much proof, Piper, because you know you do want to get a little bit of color. And 1,000, you're pretty white. Yeah, you're probably right. You might burn. <laughs> okay, Piper, you be good. You guard the uh, house from all these uh, from all these citizens here trying to get up inside there. <laughs> okay, you guys, let's go over here and let's check out this incredible brick build. So this brick build is only available for a limited time, so be sure you download it when you load up your game. It's gonna be right there, and it's gonna be incredible, and it's, it's available, and you should get it. This makes me think, like I said earlier, that maybe Survivor, the, the DLC expansion pack for Survivor is coming sooner than we think, because you guys, this definitely looks like a survivor type thing to me. You know, the pirate's flag, the bridge, just looks like it could be part of that DLC. So who knows, I could be wrong, but I might be right. <laughs> so this is really cool, you guys. I love how they've done this. I really like how they used um, the slopes and the inverted slopes to create this flag with the black and white colors. That looks pretty amazing. And I love these rock formations. And this is a great way to build a bridge. So I'm thinking someday it'd be really cool to build a treehouse type city um, and connect the different buildings across the trees with these cool bridges like this. Sort of like the Ewoks had. 
There was a movie that I used to watch when I was a kid. I don't even remember what it was called. So you guys will have to let me know in the comment section if you've ever seen it. But it takes place on the Ewok homeworld. Um, is that Endor? I can't remember what it's called, but it takes place there. And his family, <laughs> this, this is like an 80s movie. This family crash lands on the planet and the Ewoks like help them and make them better again. And they end up fighting this bad guy that lives in the cave somewhere. It's just, it's a really cute movie and it's set on the Ewok uh, world and it's so good. But back to this. So I love the way they've done this, you guys. This is so cool. So this looks like it's a crow's nest up here. And I really like the way they use these pieces to create the ladder. That's really, uh, really unique. Oh, and that's cool too how they've done this. How they've put these different colored pieces in here. And they've created this like mast kind of thing. So it, it's almost like, okay, so this is the bow of a ship. I see, that's really cool. And the ship has crashed. See you guys, I swear, this has to be a survivor thing that they're building for the survivor expansion pack because, I mean, come on, a crash ship? Look at that, that's definitely a crash ship. This just looks like a survivor site to me. <laughs> We have this sweet crab in a cage down here. And then there's this awesome anchor. You guys, look at that. The craftsmanship. This is so amazing. And I really love the way they've done this, this netting here. Okay, let's keep going up here. Um, oh, we've already been up there. You guys, this is great. This is so cool, so well made. I just love that they come out with these expansion or these uh, DLC, not DLC, what am I saying? I love that they come out with these showcase brick builds frequently because it really inspires my imagination, gets me excited about what can be built. All right, so before we check out that awesome brick build up there, let's check out the rest of Pirate Playground. So you guys remember that our friends uh, Barbara and One-Eyed Willie, our good pirate friends, actually renounced the life of piracy and they came and they crash landed near Ivory City and built a restaurant. So their pirate ship used to be parked right over here. And now, of course, you guys know it as La Pirata Loca in Ivory City. It's the Mexican pirate fusion fine dining and it is delicious. You wouldn't believe their carnitas. <laughs> Okay, and look, speak of the devil, there's One-Eyed Willie. Hey, One-Eyed Willie, how's it going? Where's Barbara? Oh, she's back at the restaurant? I mean, she can handle that entire restaurant herself. Oh, you get bored of the restaurant? Well, you know, buddy, restaurants are uh, quite a commitment. You know, that's a, that's a long work week if you're running a restaurant. It's a lot of work. So Barbara, Barbara can handle all that herself, really? Oh, she does anyway, because you just lay, lay around and uh, drink whiskey and don't do anything. Yeah, well, it's the life of a pirate, right? Right, One-Eyed Willie? <laughs> oh, hey, bro. How's it going? <laughs> okay, so let's go over here and show you guys the rest of Pirate Playground. So there's Pugsy. And we built this awesome skate ramp right over here so we could test that out a little bit later. Actually, you know what? You know what, Sheila? Why don't we just test it out right now? Let's do it. So let's put a skateboard down. And let's see if we can do this. All right, let's hop on the skateboard. Oh, you guys, look at Sheila. <laughs> She's feeling pretty cool. Okay, what happens if you, oh, oh. This is not going to be easy. Do it, Sheila. Oh, that, I mean, that was kind of good, right? Look at that. <laughs> I mean, you know, with enough practice, you could probably do something pretty cool on this, right? You're already getting kind of good, Sheila. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> So we're thinking someday we want to build a skate park in Ivory City. I think it'd be really cool to make a bunch of cool uh, jump jump ramps like this. We could have some skateboard contests. It'd be pretty sweet. All right. I wish she could flip. That'd be really neat. I don't think she can. Though. Can't flip. Can you, Sheila? Can you flip? Can you flip? No, you can't flip. But that's okay because this is amazing. <laughs> All right. Hop off that 
skateboard. Oh, you left it in kind of a weird place. All right, so then over here, there's a couple of little bungalows that you can rent if you want to hang out, spend the night uh, in the pirate playground here. I mean, they're not very big. They're not very big, but you know, there's almost enough room there to kind of stretch out your Lego legs and arms. This one's a little bigger. Still not great. <laughs> oh, hey, Dan Brickman. Hey, where are you going, buddy? Hey, how's it going? Are you having a good time at Pirate Playground? You got robbed? Really? Who robbed? Are you going to try and do the skateboard? Here's maybe we should get this down for Dan Brickman so he can uh, so he can hop on the skateboard here and use it. Here, let's get it down. Here, there you go, Dan. Let's put it in position for you and let's hop off. There you go. Go ahead, Dan. All right. All right, go ahead. Do it. Oh, you get nervous? You don't want anyone to watch? Well, Sheila, just turn around. Oh, okay. Well, he's already over it. <laughs> All right, let's go into the uh, pirate in here and let's uh, let's see what uh, see what it looks like. Oh, this is pretty cool. Do you guys hear that? Is that the fire? I wonder what that sound is. It sounds like rushing water or something. So this looks like it's the bar. These are like the little chairs and the table, and there's some food and glasses on them. There's a little fire here. And then what's back here? Is this a kitchen back here? I think this is the kitchen, because those look like countertops. Yeah, that's pretty neat. There's an upstairs too. If it's an inn, there's probably like rooms up here, right? Oh yeah, look, there's a bed. Kind of a dresser-ish <laughs> end table. Some other rooms, this is kind of cool. Oh, look at that. Nice two twin beds, I think, together in a room. Wow, oh, there's plenty of space. I mean, none of these rooms have doors, so that could be a little awkward, but but hey, you know, on a budget. <laughs> you want a budget vacation, then come check out the uh, Pirate Inn. Let's go over here and check out this incredible sky castle. <sighs> I mean, you guys, look at that. Look at the architecture. Look and... <sighs> so I don't know if this is based on anything you guys let me know in the comment section if you know what that's based on. If that's based on a movie or a game or a Lego game. I don't know. I can't tell what this... I mean, I love it. This is just incredible work. But I wonder I wonder what it's based on. Alright, let's go over here. And oh, I just heard Piper destroy someone, you guys. <sighs> let's go over here and let's uh, get on maybe our jetpack, Sheila? Let's go up to the Cloud Palace. Actually, maybe we'll use the grapple gun. We haven't used that in a long time. And I think that the grapple gun will work. What if we grapple there? Oh no, that didn't work. <laughs> okay. Let's try grappling to a different uh, section here. Let's see. Uh, what if we grapple up there? Nope, that didn't work either. Okay, well. <laughs> We tried. Let's just uh, do it the old-fashioned way, and let's get on the jetpack. There we go. <laughs> Uh-oh, Sheila. Maybe you should take off your eye patch so you can actually see out of your goggles there. Okay, let's... Oh! There we go. There we are. Let's put it away. Nice. Look at this. All right, so let's go into Sheila's point of view and check out this incredible cloud palace with these cages. How cool is this? Is there, oh, there's something in there that we haven't discovered yet. All right, let's see how close to the edge can we get. Can you get in that cage anyway? I wonder. Okay, I don't see how you can get in there. Oh, maybe from the front? Let's see. No, it doesn't look like there's any way in that cage. Let's let's jump over to it. Can we jump to it? Yes. Okay. Is there any way to get in this cage? Hmm, not without breaking it. Let's go ahead and discover whatever this is in the center here. What is that? What is that? It's a dragon skull? What? 
so this is uh okay look at the dragon head so this is some kind of dragon palace and the architecture <sighs> i love it i can't get over how cool it is i just love the way they designed and built this okay let's try and hop here <laughs> careful sheila all right let's go into sheila's point of view and let's check out this incredible dark cloud palace wow i think i hear someone in there oh there's someone in here oh hey Anubis guard how's it going buddy oh this is your new home well we love it it's awesome um who are you who are you fighting here oh this guy oh uh, i don't really think he's a threat anymore it looks like it's probably been a really long time since he was a threat but yeah you you, you keep at it <laughs> all right guys let's check out the rest of this incredible brick build Let's go ahead and climb up this ladder. All right, let's hop off over here. Hop on, hop down, Sheila, hop down, hop down. Oh, wow, look at this. I just love the way they have uh, done these arches. What a great way to get around not having any arch bricks. <laughs> you just build your own. So I think we will definitely be building a castle someday in LEGO Worlds because it looks like the options are endless for cool castles. All right, let's keep going up here. Let's jump out here. Watch out for that torch, Sheila. Wow, you guys, look at this. This detail is just amazing. They, I just love the way they use the slope bricks here, the inverted slope bricks, the regular slope bricks, and the different colors. It's a really great color combination too. All right, let's keep climbing up here. Oh, and this is the very top. Look at that. Look at the detail on this roof. Man, I can't get over how cool it is. It's amazing. Okay, that is everything in the pirate playground. Oh wait, no, there's a little farm down here. So let's go down and check out the farm. Watch out, Sheila. <laughs> let's go over here and check out the farm. And then Sheila wants to lay out and try and get some color. Hey, did you guys see the chickens? That's pretty cool. Is that a chicken and a pig? This was like one of the very first uh, quests we did was right over in here. I think we had to put some chickens down or something. In fact, it might have been the very first quest. Oh, hey. Hey. <laughs> so did we never discover this gate? Wow, you guys. What? And we didn't... And Sheila, you need to pay better attention when we uh, complete quests here. All right, let's go and lay out on the beach. This is a great spot. Well, let me go ahead and put down some uh, lawn chairs here. Let's go ahead and put down some food. We've got some lounge chairs here and, oh, a skeleton. Dude, be nice. Get out of here, get out of here. Jeez. Okay. Why don't you just relax, Sheila? Let's see if you can get some color. <laughs> Sheila's gonna relax. She's gonna get some color. She's on the beach. She's got a banana. She's got a coffee. She's got seagulls. Oh yeah, this is the life. Laying out, relaxing on the beach, getting some color. We got their Lego friends here. <gasps> Sheila! Sheila, did you, did you forget to put sunscreen on your face? Your face is completely burnt. I mean, I guess this is burnt because Sheila was yellow, so green, if that makes sense. Sheila. Sheila, do you realize how much aloe vera you're gonna need to get rid of that sunburn? <laughs> you guys look, Jestro is juggling. <laughs> oh, hi, Lady Meowington. Hi, hi. What? You forgot your bathing suit? Well, I can see that. <laughs> You guys, Lady Meowington has the cutest bathing suit, but she totally forgot it, and now she's chasing a pigeon. Isn't that cute? No, go on. Stupid skeletons. No, no, no. Oh, dang it. This is supposed to be a vacation, and here we are, battling skeletons. Ah, oh, you can't get one moment of rest, can you? <laughs> All right, guys, we've had a ton of fun in today's episode, but we have a bunch of new friends to get moved into Ivory City. And oh, look at that. Someone's actually using the skateboard. Yay! He's, he's actually way better than you, Sheila. 
Uh, we have a bunch of new friends to get moved in, so we're going to get them moved in right here so they can hang out on this vacation with Sheila. And then we'll head home to Ivory City and bring all of our friends with us. So let's go ahead and start getting our new friends placed in the pirate playground world. This is Nick, he wanted to be the chicken man and his favorite color is blue. This is Connor, he wanted to be the Spartan warrior and his favorite color is red. So Eli wanted to be the zookeeper, but I don't think there is a zookeeper in LEGO Worlds. Uh, there is a minifigure in real life, but I don't think there is actually one in LEGO Worlds. So the closest thing to the zookeeper is actually Sheila. So there we go. This is Mason, he wanted to be the astronaut and his favorite color is red. This is Celeste, she wanted to be the water dragon and her favorite color is blue. This is Beatrice, her favorite color is green and she wanted to be the forest dragon. This is Leo, his favorite color is red and he wanted to be the red dragon. This is Alexander, his favorite color is blue and he wanted to be the skeleton suit guy. This is James, his favorite color is blue and he didn't tell me what kind of character he wants to be so we're just going to put the gothic guy down for him for now. This is Chase, his favorite color is purple and he wanted to be the Tyrannosaurus Rex. This is Kirill, they wanted to be the wizard and their favorite color is green. This is Sam, Sam wanted to be the fisherman and Sam's favorite color is blue. This is Kane, Kane wanted to be the boy and his favorite color is green. This is Hampus, they wanted to be the dino tracker and their favorite color is purple. This is Liam, Liam wanted to be the goat and Liam's favorite color is blue. This is Elle, she wanted to be the loin princess but I think she means viking woman and her favorite color is purple. This is Xander, Xander wanted to be the night dragon and their favorite color is dark red. This is Logan, Logan wanted to be the T-Rex and his favorite color is red. This is Tone, I think that's how you pronounce that, T-O-N, they wanted to be the toy soldier and their favorite color is blue. This is Nick, Nick wanted to be Kai and Nick's favorite color is orange. This is Hunter, Hunter wanted to be the troll and he wants to be in a cave so when we get back to Ivory City we're going to put Hunter in the cave underneath the ivory tower. This is Dimitri, Dimitri's favorite color is blue and Dimitri wanted to be the explorer. This is Caleb and Caleb wanted to be the astronaut. This is Tiago, Tiago wanted to be the lion and Tiago's favorite color is aqua. This is Jay, Jay's favorite color is blue and Jay wanted to be Jay. <laughs> All right, guys, there are a couple characters that we actually haven't unlocked yet. Um, so we're going to do that uh, for the next episode. The Paintballer and also Squarefoot. So a couple of you guys requested to be moved in as those guys, but we haven't unlocked them yet. So we will definitely unlock them and get you guys moved in in the next episode. Oh, hey, Rex. How's, how's it going, Rex? You being nice? You guys, looks like Rex is being pretty nice. He's hanging out here and he's having a good time on vacation. <laughs> All right, guys, if you enjoyed the episode, please give it a thumbs up. Next week, we will return to building Jurassic World, starting with the Raptor Arena, and it's going to be amazing. Please leave a like if you enjoyed the episode, and don't forget to subscribe and hit that little bell so you get notifications of every single amazing Sheila adventure. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.